time there was the fact that you were able to hold those guys to one field goal. Yeah, it was nice to see. I'd prefer to see it earlier. <laughs> but, but, you know, and I just told our guys, and, and they're, a, they're a very difficult team to guard because of, obviously, when you have DeMar and Zach and Vucevic, they're very gifted scorers, and the other guys play off them very well. So they, I felt like they got going in that first quarter. They're hard to slow down, and the concern with DeMar was the free throws. And so that that was problematic for us. And uh, but I, you know, I, I like the way we played offensively. Uh, we had, I thought, really good rhythm, made threes, and we really rebounded the ball well. So I think that that part was was critical for us. And um, you know, so, so sometimes you just gotta, you know, you you have to win games different ways. And the bottom line is just find a way to win. Yeah, and speaking of the rebounds, it was a massive offensive rebound from Mitch that yeah. led to the Grimes three yeah. there late. But really, there were a lot of second efforts that you yeah. got from your team all night. Yeah, and the scrappiness, and oftentimes that's the difference between winning and losing. It's, and it's, it's a hustle play. It's a tip. It's a recovery. It's a kick out. It's a three. Uh, you know, Mitch had a, a, a big defensive play down the other end as well. Uh, we had you know, guys sacrificing, spraying the ball out. Um, we had, you know, RJ being in foul trouble, we saw there was a lot of mixing and matching going on uh, in the game. Um, you know, so the the big thing is just find a way to win, take a look at the film, make our corrections, and then uh, playing them again. We know we have to do things a lot better. At the end of regulation, there Julius has a shot to win it for you guys. That doesn't work out. But then the way he sacrificed his body on the other end to make sure that you guys forced overtime yeah, with the yeah, seven. Like, as a coach, what do you appreciate? Yeah, you know, like, and he played. He's been on on a on a great run, all the way around. And you know, the, the uh, he made so many good plays for us throughout the course of the game. Uh, and then to read that play, which he did, and then to you know you, to lay it all on yeah. out on the yeah, on, put it on the line, line is you know that's a big part of what sacrificing for the team. There's no stat right, the for that, but that you know, and then to Vegas, not right? be deterred, I, I and then to start the overtime in the right frame of mind uh, well, to like find a way to win the game. How much is effort to get the ball in Jalen's hands more in overtime? No, it was the you know we were playing through Jalen and uh, and Julius, and then we wanted to get the double team and play off of that. And usually when we have RJ, it gives us the third guy, so we can play three man game pretty effectively with the three of them. Uh, so, you know, and and again like those, we wanted to make sure you know we, there wasn't any time at the end with a tie score. So, uh, you know. Get to your spot, take your shot, and you know Julius on that. You know, it's a it's a good look on that side. You know you don't want time left, but um, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, you know, like the thing is, is, you can if you put bring a second guy over, they can they can trap. They also had a foul to give, and so you're you're trying to read that. But you, what you don't want to do is you don't want to go early where it leaves them. A, a chance, I and mean, they ended up getting. You know, we didn't uh, because the we didn't hit the rim on the play. But uh, you know, for the most part, uh, I like the way we we played. Seemed pretty good. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You know, and that's it says a lot about him. It's like, you know, it, it's everything. You know, so he's. You know, coming in multiple treatments every day, and you just know he, it, that becomes his game. That becomes his practice, and you know he's pl he's been through so many different things. You know, he, he has a strategy for everything, and you know he's just gets out there and gets it done. Um, uh, yeah, Tom, you mentioned you mentioned that winning pedigree that he has pre-game. You know, obviously Stevens High School, Villanova. But you can see the way he infuses your team with that yeah. kind of mentality. Where, where do you think that mentality comes from? Well, I think, yeah, I, well, one, I think his parents have done an unbelievable job with him. I think he's benefited from, you know, Rick has played for, like, an incredible amount of Hall of Fame coaches. And I think that 
a byproduct of that is the way Rick has taught him the game. And, and to Jalen's credit, the way Jalen wanted to be. Like, yeah, I don't want to underscore how important he was a sponge. And he was a sponge from six years old, five years old, you know. And I think that he's, Rick has taken the best from the best. And he's given it all to him. And um, in, I, I don't want to overlook the contribution that his mom has made, too, because I think that's the, it's the total package. It's, he's just a, he's a great person, he's a great player, uh, and he's made himself into that. He not only 40 minutes, 30 points from him, but overtime, seven points, and about as emotional as we've seen him at the end. Um, just when you thought about that, the effort to do that. Yeah, you know, I think in... You know, he wants to win. I think that's where his joy comes from. Is it's the winning and if if he scored two points and we won, he would be thrilled. You know, and that's what I love about him. Uh and he 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 loves to win, he loves when his teammates do well. Um I think it's been great for our team. I think it's the best type of leadership that you can have is just doing the right things each and every day. From Sunday night till pregame, that you don't know what his status is, but in your head, know what he is. You thinking? I'm gonna get 40 minutes out of. I just I listen to the trainers. That's a game time suit. And his father. Four for you. has you know he has the five early points and he gets into foul trouble. I don't think he took a shot. For what felt like two corners, and there he is hitting three big threes for you, two late in regulation, one in overtime. You know, what does that speak of? Just kind of the confidence he has, and is he? Well, I think it says a lot because he he's put a lot of work into it. You know, I think that's where you know when you ask, okay, where does confidence come from? Uh, confidence comes from your preparation, and so when you shoot as much as he shoots, and you know what we track it. You know, I could tell you left, right, depth of the shot, arc of the shot, right? This guy has made a major, major commitment, and it didn't start when we drafted him. He had that in him. Uh, if you just look at his shot profile when he was in college, it'll tell you the same thing. And so he's driven. There's He prepares himself extremely well, and every one of his teammates, if he's open, they want to see him shoot it. Coach, what are you seeing from Grimes in late game scenarios? Like now that he's started to build a body of work with that starting unit to defend the way he does, but then to knock down that three. Yeah, his confidence is, but like, it's his mental toughness too. It's his makeup. It's like to be, you know, no matter what's going on in the game, he's he's so locked into what he's doing, and he, as I mentioned, he knows he's put the work into it. And so there's no moment that's too big for him, no moment too small. And, and this is a guy, when you look at what he did, he'd been kicked and gouged in. You know, he, he transferred from Kansas to Houston and helps Houston get to the Final Four, right? That's, that tells you a lot about him. Like he, you know, adversity didn't affect him in a negative way. He, he turned it into a positive. You know, I look at what Jalen accomplished in college. It tells you a lot about him. Same thing with Deuce. It tells you a lot about him. All right. Thanks, Coach. Yeah.